friends. We're back and still on our festive bullshit. So my mom got the one that like is a competition kit. And so we're gonna have a competition of whose turns out better. And while we're decorating, we're gonna be answering some of the questions that you guys asked us on Instagram. Ugh, I don't like questions. She hasn't seen any of them, so. <laughs> Even know where to start. Is this oh, the bottom? We have to have a base, yeah. That's why I pulled out this picture. Where do these little things go? That's the sides of the house. Oh, it's all together. Yeah, to I get it now. Oh my Moment goodness. of stupidity for Brooke. Ha 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 ha. You guys should place bets on who you think is going to win this competition. I'm thinking it's going to be me. I'm thinking it's going to be me. Let's start answering some questions. All right. First one. Kelly, did you move to Florida? Yes. yes we are in her house, RN. So we've actually... I, I, when you cut this, bro. So we have a condo in Naples and have had one for like, what, eight years? Eight years. Eight years. Um, they originally got it because my grandparents live here. Her dad lives here. We would come stay. We would always spend like Christmas here, right? Yeah. But now she lives here full time in the sun. Lucky her. Do you still talk to any of the dance moms? I still talk to all of them, and she has a podcast with them, so if you don't listen, yes. tune in. Because, what is it? Because mom <laughs> What said is so it? Poor. What is it, she said. Yeah. Who's more sensitive, Brooke or Paige? Paige. Brooke is, you're not very sensitive. She's a tough cookie. Who? What can I say? Okay. Oh my god, this sucks. Have you guys ever gotten drunk together? Uh, last night. <laughs> and the night before that. <laughs> On yes, that yes. same topic, what's your favorite alcoholic beverage? Red wine. That's another question, actually. What's your favorite kind of red wine? Menage a trois. Yeah, she likes like the like $5 stuff. Oh, it's 10. Um. I'm the same way. No, but I feel like when it comes to wine, I, well, my go-to alcoholic drink right now is tequila sodas. Ugh. With a splash of pineapple juice if I'm having a rough day. It's not going down easy. But wine-wise, I like both white and red, but I think I'm more of a white fan. Oh, man. Did this wrong. I like a little Pinot Grigio moment, you know? Who's your favorite? child oh my gosh obviously I don't have a it's me child. i love my, all the same obviously all different. it's me all she different. just knows that Paige and josh could be watching this no yes this is the littlest house ever i'm having a hard time here to be honest like she's falling all over the place when were you most proud of brooke oh my i'm proud of her every day She's gonna be really proud of me after I make this gingerbread house. When was I most proud? I don't know. I'm proud of her every day. If one that just came to your mind when you thought of that question, or when I asked you. How good you are at work. Okay. We are a little workhorse over here. I feel like I'm almost out of icing. I know. Do you want pets? Yes. If you didn't watch my last video, she has a pet named Hash Brown. He's a pretend dog. He's the most well-behaved dog there is. But she might actually get a dog. My brother has two dogs and they just had babies, six of them. And they're so cute. They're like, what, three weeks old right now? And she might take one. I will have a grand, one of my, yeah, it be a, Grand baby, right? Mm -hmm. Great grand baby. Great grand dog. 
Um, that's another question that someone asked is what happened to Buddy? Buddy died. Buddy was old. Buddy needed to be put down because he was Sick. suffering. Yeah. But he was He's the in best a better place dog. now. He was the best dog. I miss that man's. He was cute. This is the cutest. What's your favorite childhood memory of Brooke? Oh my. I don't know. You should have gave me some time to think about these questions. That's not fair. Well, that's not as fun. Well, I would at least have some better answers, maybe. Like when you won the... Um... Ooh. <laughs> Blues on my roof. Um, your first... Um... Title? Dance. Yeah. Title. What was it? Petite Miss Dance of Pennsylvania. Or, or no, it was Miss Small Fry. Yeah. I think that was it. Kelly, when did you have your first boyfriend ever? Oh my. I don't even know. Mine was in third grade. I was probably sixth grade, maybe? Oh. Sixth or seventh grade? Is it falling off? I can't tell. I don't know. Mine's yes, not doing it is. very good. Like, is there like a way to make this? You have to just sit and wait for it to dry. Maybe we should just take a. Well, I need to like hold it together, okay? Uh, actually, that reminds me. <laughs> Of that one story um, where Pappy, her dad, almost drove through a boy's house because she oh, wouldn't yes. tell that story. I was 16 then. She's um, bad. No, my dad didn't. He didn't want me to go to this kid's house, and I went anyways. So he came to pick me up, and I wouldn't get in the car. And he was like, if you're not in this car <coughs> in three minutes... I'm driving through the front of the house. And he's crazy. He would have. So I did end up getting in the car, but. No, he like actually turned on the turned, engine yeah. and was like and, and about. And was starting to. So. And my mom like ran out and was like, whoa, 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 whoa. She, he used to put her picture in bars and was like, if you serve her, I'll kill you. He wasn't going to kill him. He was going to shut them down. Oh, that. Okay, Kelly, do you have any tattoos? No. No, and she's not a fan of tattoos. I get yelled at every time I think yes, she sees mine. she does not need tattoos. But Love You More is kind of like a family thing. It's for Nana, who's her mom. And I feel like she might end up getting it. I feel like we could convince her to do it. So far, me and my sister and my cousin Dominic have it. My brother's going to get it. So I think she's going to end up getting it. I'm a little old for a tattoo. Yeah, but don't, like, you oh, want that God. experience? No, I don't really Why? want to have that experience of being hurt. <laughs> it doesn't hurt that bad. Oh, okay, here's the one who got to have me come in and hold your hand while you got your booster or your COVID shot. That's different. Needles are different when they go inside of you when it's for something that you want. I don't want a shot. I don't want a flu shot. I don't want a COVID shot. I don't want any of that. Well, if you're afraid of needles, but a need of or at least when they're doing the needles insane. for a tattoo, there's a happy ending. No, it's <laughs> not. It marks up your beautiful body that I made. All right, favorite place you've ever traveled? I really liked Lake Tahoe. Yeah, I, for, I thought that was really pretty there. Even better. Okay, so that's in the U.S. What's your favorite place outside the U.S.? Maybe Ireland. People are so nice in Ireland. Yeah. So nice. Okay, did you guys ever watch Dance Moms together? Other than like the premiere. Yeah. You know, she wouldn't let us watch it. No, we lived that torture in real life. We didn't need to live it. <laughs> we didn't need to watch it again. Show. Worst thing Brooke ever got in trouble for. Uh, guys, I'm a saint. I don't get in trouble. I get away with things. When, I don't think you ever do get in trouble. I'm telling you, I'm good at what I do. Uh huh. Yeah. Which one? How come yours is staying and mine isn't? Because I'm a pro and I'm winning this competition. Which one do I like here? Well, don't copy. I know, but I'm trying to see what vibe I want to go for. I kind of like that little one right there. 
I just want mine to stay standing, like my roof keeps sliding off. Mm -hmm. All right, next question. So I didn't get in trouble for anything. I don't think I've ever really been. I used to get my phone taken away a lot for my mouth. Yeah, she always had a smart mouth, but she never really did anything bad to get in trouble. Thank yeah. goodness. No, I used to get my phone taken away from my mouth, and um, one time she was going to put soap in my mouth. Oh, Josh she, saved her. And Paige. She's like, do you want cucumber melon or do you want vanilla bean? Like, she's showing me the Bath and Body Works options I have to put down my throat. And yeah, I'm like, like, you can have vanilla or, or cucumber melon. Cucumber melon. And I'm like, I don't want either of them. And I start running around the house. And then Josh started saying bad words so he would chase her. Or so and she would chase would him. It. I wouldn't. And then do it to her. and then Paige would See, do it. And it was just like your we were, brother loved you. We were all trying to save each other here so we could avoid the Bath and Body Works soap oh. beverage we were about to have. Oh, um, we should have just not said bad things. I I don't even think I was saying bad things necessarily. You just were. I was Smart just, mouthing me. Yeah, because that's you were, bad. You probably deserved it. <clears throat> okay, that's another thing. One when, when she would take my phone, I was always scared that like something would pop up that she would see. And uh, yeah. Paige actually brought this memory up. That one time I made her go in to my mom's room and watch her on my phone. I was like, <laughs> I was like, Paige, my phone's almost dead. I need you to go in there, occupy her, so it dies before she's a chance to read. My text. <laughs> you know, those fourth grade boyfriends, we were getting serious. I didn't want her reading that oh, stuff. Oh my goodness. Kelly, where did your bob go? My what? Your bob, your little. Oh, well, I don't have a hairdresser here in Florida. Can't find anybody to give me a good haircut. And it's too expensive to fly home every time I need a haircut. If you were to fly home for a haircut, I could not. Could not with you. Okay, this thing sucks. No way I'm gonna win, win with this. Did Kelly go to college? No. She did. I knew I wanted to be a mom. I had no I, need to go to fun college. Fun fact was actually a first generation college student. My dad didn't go to college either. What sign are you? Like you're- Taurus. I'm surprised you know that. I'm a bull. <laughs> don't mess with me i'm an aquarius i'm not one of those girls that like knows anything about it though and fun no, fact i can't do my chart because my mom doesn't know what time i was born isn't that rude well does it say on you have a baby book well, where is it it's at home now that I see you. so you would just look in that well, I looked on my birth certificate and it wasn't on there. Yeah, it wasn't on pages either. Because she wanted to know that same thing. A time that you lied to your mom. Ugh. <laughs> Let's hear this. I feel like I don't lie about anything. Um. Do we believe her? I feel like I'm pretty open with her. I used to lie about, like, stupid shit about, like, where I'd sleep in, like, high school. Like, I'd be at a boy's at house. At a boy's house and tell her that I was sleeping somewhere else. What, what boy were you doing that? Like, I feel like it was with. I think I did it the first year. It was like for homecoming when we had like an after party. And then eventually, homecoming oh. became the exception that I was allowed to sleep at a boy's house. But other than that, like, no, I didn't. Because I didn't sleep over any guy's house because I dated Nolan all of high school. So he was my sleepover all the time so i didn't really lie to you about much i still don't believe you what what are like you i don't know what i would have lied to you about i don't know basically i'm a good girl didn't really lie i'm not good at lying that's another thing well, that's a good thing to not be a good liar you don't want to be a good liar Okay, um, which sister, sis, la, 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 la. which sister was easier growing up? Which sister? Would you be asking this to Josh? No, yeah. 
No, you, like me or Paige. So which daughter? Well, that's just how they worded it. Um, easier? I don't know, you want both easy. You have the smarter mouth, so I, I guess I would say Paige. <laughs> What's your favorite solo of mine? Mm, metamorphosis, I think. But like, pre-show? Well, that was supposed to be pre-show. Um, no, that's what I meant. Oh, like, inchworm. I like the inchworm. My first ever solo, I was an inchworm. Oh my god, she was so cute. I have some interesting solos. I need to like find the tapes of the ones before the show. There was one solo called Firefly, and I had glow sticks in my butt. Like, my butt lit up, and I just like shook it. Yeah, I had to sit and break apart like 50 little glow sticks before she would go on stage. I get no credit for any of this stuff that I always did for you. I feel like one of my best solos, though, was Bigger Isn't Better. I like them all. They're all very similar. You know, Abby didn't want to use too much of her brain to change things <laughs> up for anything. How many of these are? When are you guys shooting a Highland reality show because your lives are juicy? Juicy? I really do think we could have a bomb reality show because our lives are very... Um, chaotic mine alone would be a funny reality show but we were just discussing about possibly doing a podcast so i think we might have had our time with the reality show but podcast could be in order and you can hear about our lives you can talk about what we were doing yeah when or where did your mom l learn how to cook um my nanny taught me how to make eggs when I was a little kid. I used to stand on a chair in front of the stove and stir scrambled eggs. I think that was the first thing I ever learned to make. That's what, like the first thing I learned how to make too by Nanny. Yep. I feel like I, we come from a line of cooks. Her mom had her own catering business. She was the best cook. I'm not doing very good at this. I miss your cooking. We would come home every day and have a nice little meal prepped for us. Every day. Now I have to cook for myself. See? Someday you appreciate me. I do appreciate you. Yeah, yeah. Ugh. And I keep licking my finger and it's disgusting. I hate this kind of icing. Ugh. You like cream cheese icing, don't you? Yeah. All right. Well, the TV's on. I think we have a ghost. Do we hang out a lot? Well, she lives in Florida and I live in Austin, Texas. So the answer to that question is going to be no. I wish we did. Talk on the phone. Yeah. But we can't hang out. This is our hangout time. Until I can come back to Florida again. <laughs> you like the little snow dripping action you have going on. Oh, but don't be copying my shit. I, <laughs> I might put on a little bit on. Um, did dance moms affect your relationship? Dance Mom affected everything. Like, if anything, though, Dance Mom's brought us closer. Yeah, because we spent 24 hours a day together. Yeah, I feel like that's not the norm In for when you have a teenage room. daughter. Yeah. Thoughts on Brooks partying? I'm good at it. She's, she's a proud mother. Oh, yeah, I'm really proud. No, she needs to slow down. <laughs> Guys. No, I don't. Yes, she does. What fun would that be? Well, life just ain't about fun. Yeah, I work way too much. I deserve to party. <laughs> I deserve to party. As you don't. Well, we're, that's all the questions we have. So we're going to come back when these are done and see who's is better.
it's broken. <laughs> All right, this is my finished product here. You know, we got a little mistletoe, all the whites, the snow, we got snow on the window. And then here's Kelly's. She got a little more ahead of me with this. She has a man, I don't. But yeah. Fun, fun. These are a lot of work. Yes, very, you have to concentrate. I don't like But Too we're festive, thinking. we're we festive. Are. We have a tree, we have gingerbread man. We should save these and decorate cookies. Okay, I, I have some sugar cookies. We can. Maybe we'll come back with a third festive thing. Oh my. But yep, that's what our gingerbread house is. I'm gonna put it on my Instagram story and I'm not gonna say whose is who. And whoever gets the most, um, I'll do like a poll. Whoever gets the most votes it wins. So I will come back. I'll try. I hope I don't forget with who wins. Guys, let me go award the winner. First place. <laughs> She wins. I'm a proud winner. A Four thousand people chose hers over 4, mine. Over mine. No, so. Yeah, there was a four thousand gap. Wow, I mine must be really good. I, I don't think people understood the detail behind mine. Like it's snow, it's not a mess. <laughs> <laughs> but whatever, it's fine. But all right. Thank you for watching. I'm gonna work on my um, gingerbread skills and be better next year. <laughs> I'm winning this next year. You, I'm gonna remake this video next year and I'm going to have that ribbon. I'm not giving it up. Top of the pyramid. Woo <laughs> All right, bye guys, thanks for watching.